Okay, what's up, guys? So, Scarce, he was talking about this quite a few times in his uh, news videos. And uh, I wanted to just give my thoughts on it. It's nothing bad, but uh, it's uh, it's just crazy insane to see something like that. And uh, it's like congrats to PewDiePie for that even happening to him. But so anyways, he created a uh, second channel. And uh, it was like a spoof, I guess, of um, another YouTuber named Jacksepticeye. So, uh, yeah, he created a channel called Jacksepticeye 2. And I guess, yeah, within 24 hours, the channel got a million subscribers. And I was like, dang. Like, I'm thinking in my head, like, that ever happened to me. That would just be insane in my eyes. Like, you know, I'm like, dang, I just hit, like, what did I even do? Like, I didn't even do nothing. But, no, it's like, I. that's crazy. That's cool, though. That's cool that that happened to him. Like, a lot of people, I guess, because Scarce was saying that a lot of uh, YouTubers was mad at the fact that, oh, he just made a channel and just got a million subscribers like that and stuff. And I'm like, look, there's other, I have seen where YouTubers, they ain't got subscribers for random stuff on YouTube. And it's like, you know, people then got subscribers from lying, from cheating, from stealing, from doing something on YouTube. It's not like PewDiePie is doing anything bad. I wouldn't say that he's doing anything bad. And I heard that he didn't even get, I guess he didn't get no play button or something. So that could be a factor. That could be a reason why he did that and things. To get himself a play button. Like, you know, YouTube promised him a play button. Like, a lot has happened to PewDiePie this year. I'm just, I would just say that. Like, you know, bro was losing subs. He was losing followers on Twitter and things. He got unverified. Like, a lot happened to PewDiePie and things. So, it's like, yeah. I mean, it's just, hey, I don't see anything wrong with it. Congratulate. My, I'm saying congratulations to the dude, you know. Hey, it's just, it is what it is. You know, it's crazy, though. Like, it's just, you know, there's YouTubers. Like, for an example, with the, um, the one girl, Zoe Burger, she got 500,000 subscribers in, like, four three days or something i don't know but it's like look people can get subscribers from doing anything bro has 48 million subscribers you think that one million like i mean yeah it does obviously it matters and stuff but it's just like the number doesn't you know i'm pretty sure in his eyes just the number doesn't mean anything you know it's fans just being fans they supporting him just like how to the youtubers they were getting mad over the situation your fans support you you got a million subscribers. It might have taken you a little longer, but oh well, you still got it, all right? And if you don't got it, it ain't no reason to be mad about it. Eventually, you'll get it, all right? But it's like, dude put in a lot of work on YouTube, all right? To, like, have that status of having 48 million over, like, like I think he has, like, 10 billion views, you know? It's not like he's uploading bad videos, all right? There's quite a few of his videos that I do like, like his... I would say, like, a lot of his classic videos... I know he did a few try not to laugh challenges, and I like those. And uh, he did another video that I watched, and that was funny too. I can't remember the name of it, but yeah, it's not like he's a bad YouTuber. Okay, he's a good YouTuber. All right, he's obviously putting in some work, and then it's like then that was another thing. He got kicked out of his apartment for being himself. So it's like, dude, it's this should have been given to him, you know. So it's like, yeah, I can care less, you know, what happened. I mean, yeah, it's cool though. But it's just like, it's something to be mad over. Like, I don't care. I know there's going to probably be people all like, but you only got like 9,000. You've uploaded more than him. So it's like, come on. I don't, have I? I don't think I have. Let me check. Because I think he has more than I do. I know all together with both channels of mine combined, my gaming channel and my main channel, I have like over 2,000 videos. Oh, so he has over, he has close to 3,000. Okay. So, yeah, it's like, yeah, we have, like, the same amount of videos and stuff. But I'm like, I can care less. Like, I was happy at the fact that I hit a million uh, total views on my channel. I was happy about that. Like, you know, he hit a million subscribers. I hit a million views. I was like, well, I mean, I hit a million views a while ago. But it was adding up videos that I deleted. But uh, I was like, I was still happy. Like, I'm like, that's cool. That's crazy. Like, that's never happened to me before. I've never had that. Min like, I've never had that, you know? So it's like, to have it, I would say that that's cool in my eyes. But it's to be mad because somebody got more than me. I feel like that's just jealousy, you know? So it's like, I don't know. It's I wouldn't say that it's a, a bad thing. I say it's a good thing. I hope he does get his play button. I hope, you know, because it seems like, yeah, 2016 was a rough year for him. I hope 2017, it, it'll be a better year for him. So, anyways...
congratulations to PewDiePie, you know, and uh, hopefully I, I can uh, have that status one day of having a million subscribers so I can cater to more worldwide fans out there. Like, I know there's been times when I've done have fans, um, they said that they, I think they, one of my fans said that he came from, uh, Sweden or Switzerland. It was one of those two. But I'm like, still though, like that's dope to me. Like that was pretty cool. And so it's just like, yeah, it's just at least like be happy that you do have fans and subscribers and a million subscribers. Like me, I don't have it, but it's not going to change my personality or my like my outlook on YouTube or just my point of view and things. Like I don't care, you know. So it's just I'm still catering to the fans that I have and stuff. So it's like it's not like it's changing. It's not like I'm losing. It's just you know in my eyes I'm winning. You know if I'm doing better than PewDiePie I'm doing better than him. If I'm doing better than any other YouTuber I'm doing better than them. It don't matter to me. So anyways, uh yeah I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you for watching. And comment below what you think about this whole situation. Because I know there's going to probably be people out there saying like, oh, but still, he's, you know, he uh, he could just do anything in this man. Because it's like, he's like the world, he's like the Michael Jordan of YouTube at this point, okay? So yeah, he he's like the most popular YouTuber right now. So it's just, we just going to have to, you know, deal with it. It's like, it's like, really, it's just, there shouldn't be no arguments with it, but Anyways, yeah, that's that. I just wanted to talk about that, give my uh, thoughts about that and stuff. But anyways, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And if you are new, please like and subscribe and peace.